I have the curse of immortality. You may be thinking that being immortal would be amazing, and at first, it was. It was incredible. It was the feeling that I could do anything I set my mind to, with also the added bonus of living forever and healing from anything. I don't know how I acquired this power, I just woke up one day sometime in the past, and I had it. I was born thousands of years ago. I've seen civilizations rise and fall. It wasn't until my village was raided by another that I discovered my immortality. My wife at the time was killed right in front of me. I tried to protect her, but a spear was pierced through my gut. I thought I was dead as I dropped to the ground and my blood was spilled. But to my surprise, I was still conscious. In my primitive mind, I wondered if the gods had spared me. So I got back up and looked at our hut and I saw my dead wife. A rage built inside of me and I saw the ones who committed this atrocity in front of me, shocked to see me alive. But I picked up a hunting knife and ran towards them, sticking the knife in the gut of one, and I watched the life leave his eyes as he fell to the ground dead. The other took his spear and thrust it towards me and I couldn't dodge in time, so he stabbed me through the heart. I fell to the ground, but I got back up and I ripped his throat out. I understood at that point that I couldn't die but everyone else could. I looked at my wife's corpse and then carried her out and set her on the ground. I then killed every other attacker and searched for survivors in my village, but to no avail. They had all been killed. I took all their bodies and buried them along with my wife. I had nothing left, so I set out upon the world. That was during the Ice Age. Like I said, I was born thousands of years ago. I traveled across the world as the years which turned into decades, then centuries, and then millennia passed. I saw the creation of farming, the rise of the pyramids, and every major civilization that has existed, I've witnessed. It seems that I've become humanity's observer and historian, well, sort of. You obviously get bored when you live forever. When I discovered that I couldn't age, I decided to live out many different lives. From being a warrior, to a farmer, to even an artist, I've done it all. And now, here I sit in the present day, contemplating what to do next. I'm wondering if I should continue doing what I've been doing for the past who the fuck knows how long, or if I should just kill everyone on the planet. I'm so fucking bored! Just imagine how funny it would be to go to war with every country on the planet at the same time. Or shit, maybe, maybe I should just wait until technology is better, and then maybe I could go to space, explore the universe. I mean, I've got the time, so why not? Huh, I wonder if I've gone insane yet. I might have, but who cares? I just want something to do that I haven't done already. Hmm, worldwide war space. Ooh, or maybe I should just reveal myself to the world and make myself a god and have humanity worship me. Hmm, but if I kill humanity though, I'm probably killing a large percent of my descendants because I've had a lot of kids in my time all across the world. Eh, fuck it. I think I might just wait until technology is better to go to space and then kill everyone on the planet. I kind of want to discover aliens. Maybe create a galactic empire if I can find any. Might lose my mind before then, but I got the rest of eternity to figure that out. Well, you've been a good listener, Mr. Squirrel. Ah, uh, how simple it would be to have your life, but sadly, I can't have it. So go on, little buddy. Enjoy your time, and enjoy your acorns. And with that... The immortal being got up and walked into the night, disappearing, leaving the squirrel by itself.